Amos Obi is my name. I want to address you on some insight into the year we are into now, 2022. You are welcome to this brand year, which is 2 over 10. What do I mean? It's the second year in the decade of 2021 to 2030. Every 10 years is a decade. And this is second year in this decade. And uh, I'm sure you, God has a great purpose for humanity. God wants to bless the earth. Despite the challenges of COVID-19, despite all that is happening, there are great things that are going to happen. There are going to be um, new brand technology advancement. There is going to be great uh, improvement in human economy, social economy level. But before I go into detail of those manifestations of what we should expect, we must understand some basic things. Number one is that God said in his word, Amos 3, 7, that the Lord God will not do anything on earth without revealing it to his servant, the prophet. So God is said to do a new thing. On earth, the world will manifest in such a dimension and do wonders among men. To prove himself, to show himself that he is God. But how is he going to do it? That is why you need to understand his priority, God's priority for mankind. In this year, 2022, the priority of mankind is that the theme of the year is God is, is, is absolute purity and power for divine manifestation, which means God wants to manifest his, from his people to bless the earth. But that will only happen through absolute purity that will draw the power of God to his people and the people will begin to manifest in such a, gen a, a great way. His people are going to reign above circumstances. How do I know that? We look at the book of Joshua, chapter 3, verse 5, where God told Joshua, tell the people to circumcise themselves, to consecrate themselves to separate themselves for tomorrow, the Lord will do a great thing. The Lord will do wonders among you. That has been the, the, the way God is, has been working for us to enjoy, to be part of what God is about to do on earth. He wants absolute purity, separation, so that his power, his glory can reign in his people and through his people. So if you want to be among those that will enjoy the bounty, the benefits, the glory that is ahead, the wonders of God in the year 2022, you must, without compromise, get ready to walk in absolute purity so that his power can walk through you. What does that mean? God wants his people to love him better. To love him in, in such a way that they have never loved him before. To walk with him step by step in this year 2022. Where you love him and you consecrate yourself, your heart first. You give him absolutely to take charge of your heart. To reign in your heart. To walk in your heart and through your heart. Then you will going to see the great manifestation that will happen. So that is the divine pathway and the instruction that God is giving for the year 2022. The implication is that those that will walk and obey, they will enjoy the fruit of the land. If you read that scripture very well down well, you see that Joshua, among the people, after declaring the counsel of God for consecration, for separation, Joshua did and were told that God exhorted Joshua among men, among his people, among that generation, than any human being on earth. So do you want God to do something, wonders that you have never seen, for you to get what you've not gotten before, to go places where you have not gone before, for new things to happen in your life that will be a surprise to your family, to your generation. Friend, take the lesson, take the instruction from God. Absolute love and purity so that his power can reign 
when you love him above all, the scripture says, eyes have not seen, ears have never heard, nor has it entered into the heart of men. What God has in store for dead that love him. That is what we are talking of, about absolute purity and power. When you love God in such a way, such a manner that makes you to consecrate yourself, to separate yourself from the world and the system, from what is happening today, the pollution, the killing, the kidnapping, the yahoo yahoo, the what the the, the the society is corrupt. If you remove yourself and say, God, because of you, like Daniel, like Joseph, you are going to see a glory that you have never seen before. You are going to go to a level that you have never gone before. I know many of you have a lot of New Year resolution, New Year's petition, but how would they come? This is the way. You have experienced some New Year revelations and New Year resolutions, all this while, expectation, but they have not come to pass. Ah, you might be blaming this, blaming the witches, blaming that, but I'm here to show you how you can assess those things easily if you follow the instruction of God on what the way he wants to work on earth. And that way is absolute purity and power for kingdom and basement. If you dedicate yourself, say, God, I want to serve you. I expand your kingdom in the area of soul winning, evangelism, in the area of real service that come from a pure heart with his power, then you are going to go to a level that you have never experienced before. So this is the message God is sending across to everyone. It's not only for you, for every one of us that really want the best. So what, how are we going to go about it? First, you must uh, know the level you are right now. And know the level you want to go. What is the le next level for you? In fact, in, in the first place, do you what is the name? What are you calling this year? God created everything and He brought them to Adam, named them, and Adam named them. So your name, what you call this year, matters. What are you calling the year? That is the, your starting point. Your second starting point is to know, God, what do you require from me to get the best? As I said, this is a year of absolute purity and power for divine manifestation for kingdom expansion so that is a name how do we assess that is true absolute purity power consecration then you will get the best of god this year what are the best what is your expectation you should expect something what is your expectation how do you assess them this year wonders are going to happen on earth yes you should expect in the area of health, more challenges are going to come. People are going to die. But if you follow this instruction, you will not die. You will not be among those that will perish from this earth. New technologies that we have never seen will come. New phone, new computers, new way of communication, they are going to come this year. But you must get set for them. For you to accept these things. There are going to be aliens that will visit the earth. In fact, as we talk right now, Scientists are already recruiting people that can identify these aliens that will visit this earth. That is another dimension which we cannot explore right now. Maybe you get the second part of this video. It's going to explain the details, what those aliens and all those scientific things mean. So, challenges are going to happen in the terms of uh, travel across countries, but those who follow this instruction will skate through. Will skate through. So, friend. We are saying to you, if you want to get the best, follow the instruction. The instruction is, the Lord is my shepherd and we shall not want. If you make the Lord Jesus your shepherd, your leader, step by step, it will take you from the beginning to the end of this year. And even better, you will end it better. Despite the challenges in the world, you will end it better. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He leads me beside sea water. He will lead you. Even in the midst of the, 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 the holocaust, the earthquakes that is going to happen, the killing, the suicide missions and whatever, God will take you to a far level. In the political realm, there are going to be changes, changes of level. People, ordinary people are going to come into position whom God has prepared all this year. Young people are going to be raised up by God that will face the challenges of the world and finish them. Like David, who killed Goliath. The Davidic generation are going to be manifested as from this year. 
So you should, your people should get ready from the level of common living, wasteful living, to a level of usefulness, responsibility. So that is what God is saying. This is just part one of this message. I bet you to get it part two, to know more of the dimensions of how God is working on the earth and how you can benefit. Because you, can, you are not born to suffer all through your life, year in and year out, without achieving anything. No, that doesn't help. That is not the plan of God for you. So the plan of God for you to go to another level. And this is instruction. A year of absolute purity and power for divine manifestation. Thank you. I wish and I hope you get the second part of this video to guide you. God bless you. Amos Obi is my name. Thank you, Walter.